Happy Monday, Nerd Flickers! So I am in primo geeky con prep mode and basically I have been making tons of checklists going over all my cosplays making sure that I know every single piece that I need for those going over every single item that I'm gonna need to bring to have people sign and all that stuff so I have checklists coming out of my ears but one thing I can't figure out, and I know even if I take votes from you guys, I'm not going to decide probably until the day of. I have decided to use one of my bracelets to go to the Anthony Rapp signing because I love Anthony Rapp. I love Broadway musicals, especially Rent was like one of the most influential productions that I've ever had the opportunity to see. I love the soundtrack. It's just something that's meant a lot to me um, for a really long time. So, you know, I'm really excited to just get a chance to talk to him. And my biggest problem is I can't figure out what I want for him to sign when I do that. So, I like to take a vote. I have the copy of his book, Without You, which I'm leaning towards this because, you know, he wrote this book. This is his story, his journey with Rent, dealing with, you know, his mother and Andrew Larson and just everything that he went through. I tried to look for a rent playbill, but because of the success of the show and the numerous amounts of casts that have come after the original Broadway cast, uh, the playbills are $100 plus. So I decided not to do that. I did, however, find the uh, special Pride edition of the If Then playbill. Um, this is from June of 2014 where they did the Pride flag. I don't no, I think June is Pride Month, and that's probably why, but I just thought that that was really cool. Then, there is a small part of me that is also contemplating possibly bringing this DVD to have him sign the sleeve, because uh, right here is a little teenaged Anthony Rapp. He played neighbor Daryl something in Adventures in Babysitting, so I figure I could do that or I could bring Dazed and Confused and have him sign. But I really like the character that he plays in this one. And I kind of feel like this might be like a conversation starter. Um, but I can't decide. So I'd really appreciate it if you could vote down in the comments and let me know which you think I should get Anthony to sign. Um, because it might help me make up my mind um, if I agree with you or if I see you voting for something. And then I'll be like, no way, I'm not having him sign that. It might help me make my decision to get rid of one of them. Also, I designed a poster for when I meet Team Starkid uh, for their signatures. Um, I did like a galaxy type background with a University of Michigan M in the middle. Um, the eight people that they announced that are going to be there, I put their pictures on it. And the hot pink Starkid sunglasses that everyone is familiar with. And I'm going to get like a silver Sharpie to make sure that they can sign it because I'm super excited to get their signature because last year I knew about Star Kid. I hadn't really watched any of their plays, so I wasn't like a huge fangirl like I am now because now I've seen all their stuff and I am like way into them, so it's gonna be really awesome. I'm just waiting to see because one of my friends offered to take the background out of the pictures because my photo editing stuff I have can't I can't do that because my Photoshop's gone so I hope that she can do that for me because it would make the poster look better but if she can't it looks fine as it is um other than that I mean seriously my mind is geeky con obsessed I really can't tell you anything else I think my work has even been kind of fading in the background because that's really that's what I got going on. They just announced the Awkward Tea with Harry P perk that I bought um, during the HPA fundraiser earlier this year. So on Thursday, um, I have to leave one of my meetups early and I'm probably going to be late to the other one because I want to stay for the whole time. Um, I'm going to be having a tea party with Harry Potter from the Harry Potter Alliance, who's usually played by Jackson Bird, and then um, I don't remember the years that they represent, but the two Harrys from Harry and the Potters, Joe and Paul to George. Um, now, there may be an extra person or not, I don't know. Um, 
they said in the email that cosplaying as Cho Chang would be very appreciated. But unfortunately, I already have a cosplay set for that day. So we'll see if Helena from Orphan Black, you know, Im impresses Harry at all. I mean, she's probably a lot stronger than Cho Chang and doesn't cry the entire time you're sitting in a cafe on Valentine's Day, right? Um, anyway, that's all I'm going to do for right now because I am just so preoccupied with other stuff. I will talk to you guys later. I will see you guys on Wednesday who are going to be at the goodbye dinner. And I will watch the other videos as they come on the channel. So bye. Hope you have a good Monday.